Thank you, Madam Speaker. Well, here we are. Reports this morning show that we've been in a recession here in this country. And unfortunately, since coming into office, the Biden administration has been in denial about the state of our economy. And I think our minority leader, <clears throat> Mr. McCarthy, just outlined, showed uh, on the floor a little bit ago how the administration has been talking about the threat of inflation. They initially promised that it would be transitory. Then Chief of Staff insisted that inflation was only a high-class problem. And then President Biden blaming everyone except himself for causing the record high inflation that we see today. With inflation at 9.1 percent, the Fed raising interest rates again, and now two consecutive quarters of declining GDP, Americans are rightly concerned that our economy is now in a recession. And it'll be interesting to see the White House's response because up until now, instead of trying to solve the problem, the White House has instead in the previous few days been Gentlemen's trying to expired. alter the definition of a recession. Gentlemen's George Orwell expired. warned that the government will one day tell you to reject the evidence of Gentlemen's your eyes Gentlemen's time's expired. It's important we identify the problem before the gentleman's we can solve no longer recognized. Thank you, Madam. For what purpose